It's coffee time. Oh. Friday morning, so that's awesome. So I think I'm getting home from work around, I wanna say I'll be home by two, three o'clock the latest, hopefully. So that's cool to start off the weekend. And uh, I'm gonna vacuum the pool as soon as I can. There's a lot of dirt down there, but still amazed that it's clear after that storm. The water is clear, I did not lose it with that huge storm. I lost part of the house. I didn't lose the storm. I mean, the pool. So that's pretty cool. Plans for the weekend. Hmm. The only thing for sure is we have my Liz's grandma's birthday party. So we're going there. Just going back to our in-laws house for some food and there'll be some people there. I think dessert. And, um, that's the only thing for sure. I know I gotta go grocery shopping. I need to go to, like, a pharmacy at some point. Mm. That's all I can really think of. I think the weather's gonna be nice. I'm not really sure. French roast coffee? I swear, it is the best coffee in the entire world. Entire world. Do you understand that? Do you understand how good this French roast coffee is? Oh my god. Who else likes their coffee very creamy like me? Look at this. So I take a French roast coffee, which is, you know, generally a uh, harder coffee. You know, a. What's the word? What's the word? It's right here. It's a intense and hard. I, I can't think of the right word. It's not hard, but you know. Um, strong, strong, it's strong, not hard. And uh, I usually do a teaspoon of sugar and a lot of cream. So let me know in the comments, anybody who drinks coffee, um, how do you take your coffee? Because there's so many ways to take it. There's so many different kinds of sugars, how much sugar do you put, so many different kinds of creamers and milks, how much do you put. There's like additives that people put. There's... Let me know in the comments what you put in your coffee. I'm interested. This is what I've been doing for a while. I put a teaspoon of sugar and I put half and half. I like half and half better than milk. Milk is too watery. Half and half tastes a lot better. And it looks like something like that. Not very dark. I like it pretty creamy. So let me know in the comments. I'm very interested in how you guys take your take your coffee. And if you don't like coffee, tell me you don't like coffee. And, and uh, also let me know if you like tea. And also, how do you how do you take your tea? Because I know I I just put sugar in it. I don't really drink tea that much, but I did for a while. And all I did was put sugar in it. But I know some people put honey in it. I know some people put like milk in it. I never tried it because it kind of freaked me out putting milk in there. I don't know why. But let me also know in the comments what you put, how you take your tea, and what kind of tea. Also, let me know what kind of coffee. There's a lot of questions here, Roland, and you should you should start answering them because phew, there's a lot of questions. All right, I'm gonna go to work. I'll catch up with you guys later. Hey guys, so I'm home from work. It's like a million degrees out, and uh, I had a couple hanging gutters off our house from the storm. The lower one I was able to take off, cover a hole up, just so like if it rains really hard sideways, like really windy rain, it won't go in my house. And um, got the lower gutter off so it doesn't look as crappy. The upper gutter is still <laughs> hanging, but I can't reach it, so it's just gonna have to stay there till the till we get a construction company out here to fix our house. So it's really hot, and noticing our neighbor has this broken piece of huge. Oh, I don't know if you can see this on the camera. It's a huge branch. I think that's it right there. Right there, like a, three pieces broken off. And pretty much that whole thing is just hanging there. And, uh, is that zoomed in? Are you zoomed out? Okay, you zoomed out. And, uh, 
I need to get that down because I don't want that falling on my freaking head while like I hate spider webs by the way I ever mentioned that because I don't feel like letting that thing fall on my face while I'm cutting the grass I don't think I'm going to be able to get that though first of all it is pretty massive wow the ends are thin but you start going and they get pretty thick so I don't even think I'd be able to handle that myself anyway so it doesn't look like it would really be going anywhere anyway anyway I'm gonna clean the pool finally from the storm and who knows I might even jump in and then we have to go buy Liz's grandma a birthday present because we're going to her party tomorrow and yeah that's it for now let me vacuum this pool so I can go back in the air conditioning what did my wife make me for dinner today? What did you make me? Broccoli roll. Broccoli roll. That's my humongous one. That's what the inside looks like. It's broccoli and cheese. And where'd you get the dough from? I made it. You made it? From scratch? Mm -hmm. How'd you make it? Um, like how you make pizza dough. You know. With like the KitchenAid and stuff? Oh yeah, I used the KitchenAid because I used the... You could just mix it by hand, but I used the dough hook on the KitchenAid. A dough yeah, hook. That's what it's called. <laughs> wow. That looks delicious. I can't wait to devour it. And we got the dough on the table. To eat with us because sometimes she wants a pacifier and drops it every 58 seconds or less. And we have to get up, go to the pack and play, go back, sit down. And she's crying. And you gotta get up, go back to the pack and play, and sit down. Like about 18 times. So the dove is here, although she looks sleepy anyway. She just ate. Time to eat. I noticed you didn't get me a drink. Yeah, I was just gonna say you didn't. It's kind of messed up. You got yours, you didn't get mine. Oh well. I actually might make myself nice tea. Really? You win those iced teas. I know. Such an iced tea fiend that girl is. So Liz just went uh, shopping for her grandmother's birthday party uh, tomorrow. I stay, I'm staying home because it's just, I don't know, it's easier if she just runs out. So I got the task of making brownies. Mmm, brownies. I love brownies. So, instead of just making them, I'm going to take you with me in a little time lapse. Time lapse brownie. So, um, that's pretty much it. Going to make brownie, uh, uh, brownies. I'm going to make brownies and then just pretty much catch up on YouTube again. Pretty much like every other night, catching up on YouTube. So, okay, starts with putting the oven to three 50. Make three, five, zero, start. All right, let's time lapse this crap.
Ooh. Brownies, brownies. Look at those brownies. Those some good brownies. Oh, it's a hot. It's a hot. Ouch. Those are hot, the brownies. Look at those brownies. Oh my goodness. Such a brownies. Oh, oh. So I'm gonna devour this brownies and I'm gonna have some coffees and I'm gonna catch up on the YouTube. So, brown out.